Simple Learn English Parts of Speech The term parts of speech refers to the grammatical category or classification of words in a language based on their syntactic and semantic functions. It helps us understand how words function within sentences and how they relate to other words in terms of their roles and meanings. The concept of parts of speech is fundamental to understanding the structure of a language and constructing meaningful sentences. There are eight main parts of speech in English, each serving a specific purpose. 1. Noun. A noun is a word that represents a person, place, thing, or idea. Nouns can be categorized into common nouns, example, dog, city, and proper nouns, example, John, New York. Nouns can also be further divided into concrete nouns, example, chair, apple, and abstract nouns, example, love, happiness. Example of sentences, the cat is on the table. 2. Pronoun. Pronouns are words used to replace nouns to avoid repetition. Common pronouns include he, she, it, they, we, you, me, him, her, and us. Example of sentences, she is going to the store. 3. Verb. Verbs are words that express action or a state of being. There are three main types of verbs, action verbs, example, run, eat, linking verbs, example, appear, and helping verbs, example, have, will. Verbs are essential for constructing sentences, as they convey the action or the existence of the subject. Example of sentences, he runs every morning. 4. Adjective. Adjectives are words that describe or modify nouns and pronouns. They provide more information about the noun or pronoun they are attached to, such as color, red car, size, small dog, or opinion, delicious food. Example of sentences, the red balloon is in the sky. 5. Adverb Adverbs are words that modify verbs, adjectives, or other adverbs. They provide information about how, when, where, or to what degree an action is performed. For example, quickly, she ran quickly. Example of sentences, she sings beautifully. 6. Preposition Prepositions are words that show the relationship between nouns or pronouns and other words in a sentence. They often indicate location, in, on, under, direction, to, from, time, before, after, and more. Example of sentences, the book is on the shelf. 7. Conjunction Conjunctions are words that connect words, phrases, or clauses. There are two main types of conjunctions, coordinating conjunctions, example, and, but, or, and subordinating conjunctions, example, because, although, which join independent and dependent clauses, respectively. Example of sentences, I like both pizza and pasta. 8. Interjection. Interjections are words or phrases used to express strong emotions, such as surprise, joy, or dismay. They often appear at the beginning of a sentence and are followed by an exclamation mark. Examples, oh, and wow. Example of sentences, wow, that's amazing. Understanding the role and function of each parts of speech is essential for constructing clear and grammatically correct sentences in English. By recognizing the parts of speech of each word in a sentence, you can better understand the sentence's structure and meaning.